You don't find every interesting truck in the world at Truckfest. This 1950s American white superpower tractor unit was on show when we took a stroll on Maybank Holiday Sunday, a few hundred yards from my front door at Felixstowe in Suffolk. We managed to track down owner Nick Marshall for a brief chat. This is an amazing truck. Where did you come by this then? Well, thank you. Yeah, I, I've had it four years. Right. Uh, I literally found it in my travels. Right. Um, I looked all over for one. Um, end up finding it local in Dunmo. Really? So, which is a bit unusual. Yeah. Um, yeah, and there's no other story to that really. It was in a very poor state. Right. Um, we had to source rear wheels. Uh, we had to make bumpers, uh, mm -hmm. no electrics, mm -hmm. uh, had to respray, and just generally overhaul it. So Could you get drawings to work from, or did you have to work, work from what was left, really? No, no, just from what we had left, yeah. and uh, I quite prided myself because we haven't had one part from America. Right. So we've made everything, everything we couldn't find. Yeah. What about yeah. the engine as well? The engine the is the original engine. My, my first idea was to change the engine. I was going to make a hot rod out of it. Right. I got a diesel engine in. Yeah. But uh, once we started tinkering with it, we had it running within a few hours. Really? Yes, and I thought, uh, what a shame, you yeah, know. Yeah. So we, we changed plans mm -hmm. and uh, went back to original. Excellent. Yeah, and now it's got a, well, it's original engine, which is a six cylinder, 4.2 petrol right. side valve. Right. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, not so, very quick. No, I was going to say, tell me about how it, how it performs. Uh, well, we, it's about a 45 mile an hour machine. Right. Um, it's got a bit of a sweet spot at 45. Right. Uh, the unusual thing about it is it's five speed, which is quite a thing right. for 1952. Yeah. 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 Um, the economy's not brilliant. Go on, tell um, me. We're somewhere between 9 and 11. Guns Le Mans. Yeah. <laughs> no, miles per gallon. <laughs> <laughs> uh, although I tell a wife 19. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Um, but uh, yeah, I mean it's only a show vehicle, so yeah, it's uh, yeah. you know it's not something we're running every day. So. And it's your baby, really? It is my baby, and, and we've had some good fun. I've only been on the show circuit two years. Right. Uh, we've had uh, four best in shows, which right. I never, I never really? even knew they judged vehicles. That's so annoying. Really? Yeah, yeah. So uh, and then next month we are on the front cover of Classic American. Excellent. So uh, it's been gone really well. Yeah, yeah. More than I could. Uh, so yeah. tell me, tell me the one thing I want to ask because we cater for a lot of current drivers who run around the country with 44 tons underneath them. Right. Told. What can you tow with this? What would it tow in its heyday? I, I, I was on the plate, it's yeah. saying 18 ton. Right. Uh, I don't know. I would. I mean, I, I haven't had weight on it. No. I've only dri uh, driven it as a tractor unit, yep, yep. apart from the small caravan we yeah. tow around. Uh, but I don't know. I'd question that. Yeah. Because the brakes, the brakes are good. Yeah. Uh, the brakes are like brand new. Yeah. But um, you've still got to be on top of the game, you know. Okay. Yeah. Tell me something. Are they still making whites, or is it? Is uh, to dead? my knowledge, I don't think so. Right. Um, I, I know they've got a long history of going into production and out of production, and they've right. done all sorts of other things as well. But right. um, yeah, I don't know. I'm really only interested in the fifties, uh, as far as trucks are concerned, because um, it's just you know. It's almost an art form, isn't it? The it, light, is. You know. it is. Tell me um, something. Are you going to buy another one, or are you going to just keep <laughs> going with this one? Because no. it tends to be the case that blokes who buy one of these a few years down the line. Well, I saw this other one. I thought, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. I quite fancy that as well. I've I've resisted a few on on the, uh, over the few months, right. and uh, I, I think no, I want to keep this nice. Yes. I've got a few old cars, and I've got enough, you know. And I think if you get lots of stuff, you don't necessarily treat it. Right. I'd rather have a few and have them nice rather than lots and, you know, a bit yeah. scallywaggy. You know and, your, I mean? and your wife might never talk to you again. Maybe not. We'd like to get more of the background on this truck when we have the chance. See you soon.